New tonight, Miami-Dade Animal Services setting the record straight about the old facility in Medley. That's where they say they're temporarily housing pets as their main facility is so overcrowded. Yeah, we've received emails from our viewers who are concerned about the conditions at the old shelter, and we sent our Peter Dench to take a closer look. He joins us live now from the facility with what he found. Peter. Well, Lauren and Elliot, many of you may not be aware that this older Miami-Dade Animal Services facility shelter is still operating, even though they moved their main headquarters to a new site in Doral some seven years ago. This is all happening in large part because of overpopulation and overcrowding of dogs. We took a tour of this Miami-Dade Animal Services shelter in Medley, where the county is caring for 128 dogs. Unfortunately, with this national crisis that is happening right now across the country, overpopulations in shelters and rescues, everyone is feeling the crunch, and we're doing the best that we can. We've had to maximize the resources that we have available to us so that we can meet the needs of our homeless pets in our community. Many of the dogs need medical treatment or have problems with their behavior. Right now, across the country, there's just not enough adopters, and the pets still keep coming in. So because of this um, lack of adoptions that is happening across the country, um, it, it just it means that our pets are staying longer. It's taking longer to find them forever families. Flora Beal of Miami-Dade Animal Services takes us on this tour after a viewer emailed to CBS News Miami, complained of deplorable conditions here and a lack of staff, to which Beal says... We have a team of dedicated staff that is um, really just trying to make sure that they get the best possible care that we have for them. That means that we have kennel staff that comes here. They feed them. They clean. Uh, as you can see, the facility is extremely clean. They have food. They have clean water that they can drink. Um, there's also veterinary care that comes out here. There's a technician that's assigned here every day. The viewer email from a pet rescue organization also complained there was no air conditioning here for these cooped up dogs. So we do have an open air, so that, that would require a whole lot more than just putting an AC unit in. Um, there is uh, fans all around, and when you walk through there, you can, you can actually feel the breeze, and the dogs feel that breeze throughout the day. Flora Beal tells us that this is a no-kill shelter, and she says the county is caring for a total of 650 dogs. She says anyone who wants to adopt should go to their headquarters in Doral. We are live in Medley, Peter Danch, CBS News, Miami.